Greetings and salutations, everyone. Welcome back. A lot's happened, not gonna lie. It's basically at the end of the day, the, uh, my capture card's dead. So we've had to resort to some pretty crazy antics to get some sort of content rolling here. But we make do with what we've got. So, we notice, so we're playing Pokemon Red, but this isn't a normal Pokemon Red. This is called Pokemon Pure Red. It's a hack ROM that somebody created where you could find all 151 Pokemon. I know it's got some additional changes as well to it as a result of all that, but we'll just see what's all, all what's what here. You know, check first options. I need it on fast. Go super fast here. All right, we've got a lot, a lot of text boxes to go through. So. Uh, before, like, I had the capture card, which would capture either, like, the console or the laptop, and then go to the streaming computer. Uh, nowadays, I have to stream directly. Uh, where's you? Yeah, I found you. Alright. Uh, I'm now actually just running the, uh, the capture software right on the laptop itself. So it makes some interesting interesting things here. Oh, I'm gonna call him Joe! That's a, that's a given right there. Alright. So, it's a little unusual, but we... We're gonna try our best. As a result, though, of me of just, in essence, running off of one computer for capturing, uh, streaming's not gonna be an option. This was difficult enough to get an HP up right off the bat. That is different. Alrighty, then. It's just all right. I prefer the potion because that's actually safer, but safety's not on the menu today. All right. But yeah, so we're gonna hold off on streaming because I gotta go do some shopping for another another capture card to see what's what. And I know it's not the computer because I tried to use the laptop as a basis for it. I uh, basically just had the same problems as. Uh, the computer that I do use normally for recording and streaming. So that was... I was like, alright then. Uh, yes, yes. It's, oh no. It's, I forgot, I'm sorry. Forgot to, to mute... Mute the Alexa. It happens. Uh, no, no, I'm trying to... I'm trying to just scroll through the text. Alright, this all looks... I don't even care about the other Pokemon. The fact that it's a Charmander just tells me that... Do I even need anything else? Like, even if it was a Mewtwo, I'd be like, No, let me have the Charmander. Let me just... Just straight up go for it. Tell you what I will do first. Just cause I can! He's now will be slightly stronger. Alright. So, yep. The other reason, too, is this love, like... Like why I probably won't be streaming for hours, I'm hoping to have a new job very shortly. Hoping is the strong word here. Here we go. I didn't even raise it! It's interesting it starts with pound rather than scratch. It's just an interesting thing to look at. See, normally the... Normally, like, the potion is there for safety. Because you never know if he's just going to straight up just keep on tackling for days. Preferred actually just for him to keep on using Tail Whip, because we'll get several hits this way. One more Tail Whip should actually give me the yes. I'm hoping that this all works out here. All right, come on. Oh, ho, ho. so close, Charmander. But we don't care. We don't care. It's just a nice boost to his level, make him a little bit stronger. Not to mention, give him the extra money there. Yes, yes, alright. One of the oddity things that we've seen with recording on the same system is the audio seems to kind of be, for lack of a better word, muffled? We're gonna hope that in post that it gets fixed when we do a little bit of editing. And just Hope is a strong word. That is the title of this video. It's hope. That is what it is. It's, like, I'm not... 
Recording like this is not ideal conditions, but we might as well do something. And since I can only capture basically what's gonna be on the the laptop, it means that we're gonna have to put pretty much every other project on hold. Sad day indeed. Sad, sad day. Oh, we're gonna go to the mart first. Do I even have to heal? I can only, yes, okay. We're good. We can just walk through. So this is at least all the same song and dance here. There's nothing unusual here. We'll definitely be doing a lot of comparing and, and contrasting between this and regular version. But... Uh, interestingly enough, I had, ha I had in the future planned to do, like... Uh, a series of videos based off of just different ROM hacks that you can find out there in the world and just kind of compare them. And due to the capture card not working, we've been forced our hand to up the schedule as it were. So we'll go with this until we kind of figure out what to do. Luckily, in like the past, gosh, I want to say like five or six years, Possibly close to seven that since I first bought my capture card they've made cheaper ones Where they're a little bit more I guess specific where it's like it's just kind of more raw feed rather than like it comes with software to help you out and all that but I Can work with that We just got to just do some shopping to find like a good one. That's a cheap price Yes, we got the Pokedex, cause we're so cool! Alright, now, 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 don't tell me more. So yeah, eventually we'll get everything figured out. But in the meantime, this game will have to do. I think we're just gonna stick with doing one... Uh, just basically one... Uh, one uh, video p per recording session. Instead of the usual two that we would do. Just kinda till we get get our feet on the ground, make sure everything is at least living up to my standards. Alright, here we go. Not to mention, I'm using slightly different software than I normally use compared to uh, the streaming computer. So, it's got some upsides to it, but it's a, it's a little bit different working with it. Okay, so there are definitely some differences. I noticed it as well when I was just Letting it idle on the title screen, but some of the sprites are actually different uh, for the Pokemon than they are from the original game. It's not technically a bad thing, some of them might look better. But that Pidgey looks slightly different. It's generally the same song and dance, but it has like its beak open, whereas in the original it's closed, so. Might see some major changes along the way. We're gonna first grab just a couple Pokeballs. Gonna need them to capture them all. So, from what I understand, all 151 Pokemon can be caught slash evolved. Uh, even like the big legendaries. Uh, it's just a matter of just going around and finding them, basically. I think you can still encounter like the legendary birds in their actual location. I, I just think that it's impossible that uh, there are wild encounters as well. This is actually impressive, the fact that no Pokémon appears right here. Let's, let's just... Let's just remove it? <laughs> just... Alright then, I'm just gonna walk away. Walk away, because normally that's where we go to try to find a Spearow. It's just, it just sits right there. But today is not the day to be looking around. So weirdly, you might remember long, long ago, I actually did a streaming series of kind of a similar game where uh, we played Fire Red Omega, which was uh, like which was a harder version of Fire Red, and it had uh, the capabilities of finding all like all, all the three from first to third generation Pokemon inside it. So, and this is the... I don't know if this came out first and then Fire Red Omega, or if it was Omega, then this game, I just... Why would I do some fact-checking? Just pull a trump and just state it as fact. 
Easy peasy. I like that style better. If I say it's true, it's gonna be true. Alright. Okay, good. We wanted the Rattata. Just kinda... We just need some... Just need to pad out to the... The thing here. I'll tell you what, though. I think I have to actually move the camera just slightly. I think it's just slightly off-center. To be fair, with all the... I've had to move, like, wires around and stuff, and it's just... It's not as pretty as I would like it to be. But... All the wires are connected to where I need them to be to make everything work currently, so it's a plus. Alright. There we go. Rattata. Don't need it. Alright. Do a little heal up in case we need to use Rattata and Pidgey. And just go all the way here. Back to the Poke Center. It's the fun stuff here. The nice part, I will say. So, I li like, I've always had a good a good sense for, for time and whatnot, like how long it's been and and whatnot, but what the current way of everything set up is, I can actually see what the recording timer is. I don't have to, I don't have to guess and, like, look over to where my monitor usually would be. I can actually just straight up be able to just glance over on the same screen. It's an unusual feeling. It's just silver linings and all that. Alright, I'm not surprised we didn't find any Pokemon. I'm convinced. There are no more Pokemon, it's just Pidgeys and Rattatas. That's just... That's all it is in this game. Okay, that's a rare candy, which is interesting. That's normally a... Uh, antidote. I'm pretty certain of that. Now, Viridian Forest is always unusual because there's actual patches of grass in the original game. It's even more unusual. Pretty certain it's a Pokeball. But in the original game, there's actually patches of grass that are that don't actually have any Pokemon inside of them. Just the way that it was just programmed. Like no, no faults towards the programmers. You know, it's, it's the Pokemon Red was, had to be hand programmed. And there was not couldn't just automatically make the engine do stuff. You had to make sure that you told it what to do. And so it's got some rough edges, but it's still one of the better Pokemon games, in my opinion. I'm a nostalgia fan, what can I say? What can I say indeed? Alright, I'm gonna need this Caterpie to kindly join my team. I'm gonna ask very kindly here. Okay, there we go. There we go indeed. Alright, so now... We're gonna do some hunting. Cause we do want the, whatchamacallit, the Pikachu. Okay, so we found gr Pokemon here at that section. I'm thinking about catching the Weedle. Thinking about it? I'm going to. Cause we, because of how long, like, we didn't basically find Spiro, which is what I wanna find. I'm a little scared, cause the Weedle's actually quite strong. So that'll help out, actually. The problem is, do I risk another hit? Yes. Yes, we will. If it's another crit, so then it's a goodbye. Yes, okay. Oh, that was... Jumping the gun there. Jumping the gun there. Because normally we'd find, like, a spear or possibly a Nidoran... Nidoran male, but... We haven't quite yet, so we're gonna just add him to the team, just to be safe. And what we would really like is a Pikachu. Not necessarily for against Brock, Pikachu's gonna be useless in that regard. But Pikachu would be very useful for Misty because Charmander does not do so well against the water types. It's a weird, weird concept there. So basically what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna sit here, do my thing, we'll cut to finding us a Pikachu at some point in the future. Probably gonna be several decades. But I will catch you on the flip side. <laughs> okay, that took what? Like four minutes? Four minutes for a level three Pikachu. I was hoping and praying for that. Okay. All right, if he actually knocks out the Charmander, it's not a terrible way to go. Let me actually... Oh, right, they're slightly injured. 
Okay. I'm like, okay. Just please don't knock him out. Please don't. I could do safety saves. But we're not going to. I actually would have preferred the growl the first time around, Pikachu. Okay. I have two Pokeballs. Come on, buddy. Okay. Oh. Well, no joke. Probably four minutes, just me straight looking for this Pikachu. Okay. No, I don't want to give it another nickname. We're not about nicknames. Just then, and then we go. I'll tell you the other thing, too. I, I thought about this while I was looking around, doing a whole lot of nothing. Uh, there was, I also haven't seen any Metapods or Kakunas, and usually you do find those. So, that's been interesting. To be fair, in the original Pokémon, they're kinda useless. Not gonna lie. Like, you'd rather honestly just have, uh, the... Just get the Caterpie and Weedle and evolve that way. They are not... They are not playing kind today. Okay. So, we're gonna heal up here. That is what we are want to do. Because we gotta go... Gonna have to obviously go face Gary again. I believe from the re notes that they changed how your rival, like what Pokemon your rival has. He'll keep the starter around for a while, but he typically, uh, but he's supposed to have different Pokemon that he can throw in there to spice things up. So that could get interesting. We'll keep an eye on that. See what's what. But I think for now, we're just gonna park ourselves nearby, and we'll call it a day. I've gotta do some editing on this video, kinda make sure that the audio is in a good quality and all that. You know, boring stuff. Since this is our first official trip to making videos again with limited software and hardware. And everything. Limited everything. But... Yeah, I don't think there's any Pokemon here. Usually it's pretty easy to find a Pokemon here. Oh, okay, now you want to show up. Now you want to show up. Alright, found a Nidoran female. Not particularly useful right now. Would prefer the Nidoran male anyway. But, that will be it. We'll continue this next time. Thanks for watching. It's good to be back, even if we have to kind of take a side detour from our usual stuff. But... Hope you're enjoying your day. I will see you next time. Take care, everyone.